Well, here we are. It's Sunday, the 8th of September, viewers, And today, two years ago, move you up a bit. This fine dear lady left us, didn't she? She left us all to it after a lifetime of being our queen. So let's go and have a look and see what's being said about poor... Do you miss her? I miss her so much. Bless her little heart. Come on, girl. ...to announce their findings. What's coming on? Very briefly, do, do you... Do you do what... How do you Come think back. We could have a memorial? Would it be a statue, a special garden? Mm. Is there any way that you think the nation could could actually um could actually remember her properly? Well, I think it could be. Well, uh, what peeves? Yes, yeah, right. Well, what peeves me off about that is that memorial should be up by now, shouldn't it? Really, I know Queen Victoria's was pretty soon slapped up after she passed on in nineteen oh one, um, and they're still having meetings about having meetings about having this memorial. I know somebody wanted to put her on the last plinth of uh, Trafalgar Square, where you've got the lions, if you're abroad, Trafalgar Square. It's the big needle in the middle of London, outside the British Art Gallery. Um, is it the Portrait Gallery? That might be just the Art Gallery. Uh, if you can hear my grandson, it's, it's that going on. Um, yeah, uh, you've got the memorial to Nelson, Horatio Lord Nelson. And you've got the lions that sit around the perimeter of the memorial. And they've always got one spare plinth, which somebody, I don't know who, mooted, uh, putting like a nice statue of the late Queen Elizabeth on it. And a certain person that may or may not be, but actually is the Mayor of London, said no. Said no, you see. Yes. So I'll leave that hanging there for what it's worth. Anyway, let's go on. Right, let's go, right, let's go here. Let's go. On. Come on. Let's go. Look. And I feel privileged that I worked with for four years, and I think, and, yeah. and, and they've travelled to some amazing places with her and saw some amazing things. I mean, from the White House. Mm -hmm. I mean, when, when, yeah, well, I don't really want to listen to my all my, all my yesteryears. Um, I have heard about Harry's upsetter. It came out. Well, we, we kind of guessed that at the time, us, especially us older people that know how these things go. Uh, that it really did badly affect her, the last years of her reign, there we go, that's a lovely picture, uh, the last years of her reign were sort of fouled up by a certain couple that we won't mention, um, and for the whole tension in the family, and now there's all this between William and him, and he wants an apology if he comes back, and she won't come back, because she's, it's a security summit or other, to bring the children, but I mean, you know, not being funny, you never see the kids anyway, so... For what that's worth. Uh, <laughs> anyway, we will miss Her Majesty, our great late Queen Elizabeth II. The greatest Queen Elizabeth since the first Queen Elizabeth. So I'll leave that with you. God rest her soul. Bye-bye now.